Welcome to Erdos Miller MicroPulse Moments. This is a new series highlighting the features of our MWD controller and how to use them. Today we'll be showcasing the Pulse Overdrive feature. Pulse Overdrive allows you to increase your effective data rate while maintaining the same hydraulic pulse width, enabling you to get faster data rates and more telemetry to surface while still maintaining a large detectable pulse on surface. Traditionally, the hydraulic pulse width that the pulser creates is directly coupled to the data rate of the telemetry. Pulse overdrive allows you to decouple the data rate from the hydraulic pulse width of the pulser. For example, if you're running a 50% pulse overdrive percentage and using a 0.25 second data rate, the effective hydraulic pulse width with the 50% pulse overdrive will be 0.375 seconds. Pulse Overdrive works by increasing the actual commanded pulse width while maintaining the center of the pulse by 25, 50, 75, or 100%. The majority of our customers use 50% Pulse Overdrive. Pulse Overdrive allows you to effectively get either increased pulse height on surface or an increase in data rate for free without any compromises. Pulse Overdrive is a feature that is supported by MicroPulse and Eclipse Touch. I'll show you now how to set up Pulse Overdrive in Eclipse Touch. Navigate to the MWD pane and then select the editor. On the Sequences page, there is a section for Pulse Overdrive. When you enable Pulse Overdrive, you can set the Pulse Overdrive percentage from 25 all the way up to 100%. We'll set the Pulse Overdrive to 50% and we'll store the configuration. This table shows the data rate on the left side, the pulse overdrive percentage across the top, and the effective pulse width in the table itself. For example, with a 1 second pulse width and a 25% pulse overdrive, your data rate will be the same as a 1 second data rate with traditional systems, but your actual hydraulic pulse width will be 1.25 seconds wide. Or with a 100% overdrive, your data rate will be equivalent to a 1 second MRE pulse width, but the actual hydraulic pulse width will be two seconds wide. This has been an episode of Erdos Miller's MicroPulse Moments. If you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe and let us know what you think.